Let's get Mr. Ricky Carruth up here. And that's what I had to learn through losing everything because when I lost everything the first time, I thought that my business was correlated to the market. If the market's doing great, my business is doing great. If the market's doing bad or crashes, my business is doing bad. Not the case. This market cycle and back in 2008 was needed for me to be able to get where I wanted to go because my business expanded with the market. The market surges back 110% of the time. 110! Not 100, not 90, not 98, 110. It always surges back. You have to put yourself in position where your business is positioned to take advantage of the resurgence. If prices go down, think of how easy it is to sell real estate. If you see transactions slow and inventory go up and prices start to go down, don't think, oh my God, let's start backtracking and maybe I need to get out of the business, maybe I need to find another job. You need to say, oh, here we go. Let me, let me lean into this. Let me find people that want to buy, need to buy at lower prices. You got to lean in. You can't back off of this business. There's too many agents that want your position. Would you dump your cold calls or social media during that time frame to get that appointment, to physically go and do all the paperwork? The four highest priorities for an agent, okay? Showing property, listing appointments, writing offers, and negotiating offers. So if it's one of those four things, one of those four things trump everything else, including calls. Everybody's like, appointment, 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 you know? Right. And I'm like, why? Like, you don't yeah. know, yeah. you don't know, you don't know that that's the next step. That's the problem is the coaches, they try to force, they try to get the agents to force the appointment on every call. Mm -hmm. And I'm like, but we don't know that that's the next step. And you have an agents force that conversation because they're focused on what? The listing. Right. See, I'm not focused on the property. I'm using the property as an excuse to get into a conversation to see if I connect with this person. Together. Okay, okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. Layla, you got me on my knees. Hey, Layla, how you doing? Good to see you. We just had an incredible event here, and we absolutely crushed it. So, Layla, I have Ricky here, and he's a real Alabama person. So, I'm trying to get him to talk to you, like in your. I'm a real Alabama person, all right? Real human being from Alabama, all right? <laughs> Right. How many guys are new agents? Okay. First words of advice, never raise your hand or admit that you're a new agent. <laughs> Don't tell nobody. <laughs> That's what you see.